I'm not saying nothing, bro. The weekend. My dear melancholy, bish. Six tracks, but it's uh it's okay. It's okay that it's six tracks. We in this bitch. Track one, call out my name. crying bro I am crying this is the first track on here and I can relate bro bro this is what we wanted man this is what we asked for and we got it bro the vocals I am crying the lyrics I am how how do how those gay how those gay guys say it on YouTube my wig slay queen slay no disrespect to y'all, I love y'all, but damn, son. This is what we wanted, bitch. This is what we wanted, bro. This first track already is better than this. And better than Beauty Behind the Madness. And you could debate your grandmother. I don't give a damn, son. The lyrics, the vocals, everything we wanted. I love this song already. And it's only six songs on here. Bro, we gotta go to the next track. Oh my gosh. Um, track two, Try Me. <laughs> son hold on son those lyrics that he just said right is bringing me back to to, to 2014 right when he would perform um um down low he would perform down low and those same lyrics he would perform with so he's using lyrics from 2014 and he put them in his bitches <laughs> Bro, bro, this is already better than Starboy. <laughs> this is already better. It be two tracks in, bro. Nah, man. Yo, I love this, bro. Dead ass. I freaking love this, man. Um, the instrumental. The instrumental, I really, I really love that instrumental, yo. And then, and then you got Abel, just like the vocals, man. Like the vo he's not playing on this one, bro. The vo like, bro, we all know the weekend can sing, but it's like he's he came on this bitch with an agenda. I'm about to hit you in your ribs with these vocals, and you gonna take the pain, man. Oh my goodness, yo. Track three, wasted times. <laughs> Who is it, bitch? Huh? Who you seeing? Cause it ain't me. Bro, track three, wasted times, bro. My son is like, yo, who you seeing, bro? Who you out there talking to, cuz? Who, who, who you going to in and out with, huh? Who, who gave you them 20 piece chicken nuggets from Mickey D's, huh? You know I'm the only person who used to do that for you with the medium fries, bitch. Who else paying for them joints? Not him. Son, Abel came to play. He, he, he ain't come to play with this one. Abel ain't playing, bruh. Abel ain't playing with y'all on this, man. Track four, I was never there. What none of 
of y'all say this is 50 million times better than Starboy in its entirety. And if you want to come on the video talking about... <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> Debate your freaking grandmother, as I said. Abel came on this bitch, and he's not playing with nobody, son. He ain't taking no prisoners on this, boy. The vocals, the instrumental slap. I don't know how you cannot like this, bro. Honestly, I mean, if you don't like it, you don't like it. But I don't know how you can. I don't know. I don't know, bro. I, 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 I don't know. Track five, Hurt You. <laughs> Yo, this some 70s ass beat, bro. This is legit some 70s instrumental. You in the you in the low rider, six foe, cruising down the street, wind blowing in your hair, your girl sitting next to you doing cocaine off your left leg and shit. This is fire! He listened to us, man. <clears throat> he listened to us, bro. Dead ass. He listened to us, bro. He freaking listened to us, man. I can't even think of nothing, bro. All I know is he listened to us, bro. He got his money. He secured the bag. And then he said, "Yo, I gotta drop. For, I gotta drop some. I gotta drop some. I can't talk right now, cause this this EP got me all types of messed up." He went and he dropped something for the OGs, bro. That's all I can say about this, man. Final track. Track six. Privilege. My mind, my, my mind has been blown. Seriously, um, I'm gonna keep it real with you, Chief. If you're a fan of the weekend and you don't like this, eat my freaking toes, dead ass. I don't care if you just started listening to the weekend two hours ago. I don't care if you just started listening to the weekend two years ago, bitch. If you were talking about the weekend. And you don't like this. You a bitch. And I'm saying that with, with the utmost respect. Because there's going to be people telling me that they don't like this. There's going to be people saying, I didn't really enjoy it. It's overhyped. It's overrated. Well, guess what? These nuts ain't overrated. These nuts ain't overhyped. And you could get on your knees and say, please, as I blast this freaking EP in the background, bitch. This EP is exactly what we asked for. This EP is exactly what we needed from the weekend. I said this before and I say it again. I know what the weekend is capable of. The weekend has been able to give us trilogy. Kiss Lane. Beauty Behind the Madness. Then he came out with Starboy. Starboy completely different from the old stuff. We all saw it. We all know it. Right? This EP come out. And it's like I'm listening to... I don't want to compare it to House of Balloons. But it's like I'm listening to his old stuff for the first time, bro. For real. The vocals... The vocals got way better since 2011. Let's be real. The vocals... The lyrics... Whoever did the instrumentals on these um songs... Shout out to them... Drop the full project now. Drop the whole damn thing. This is what you call freaking consistency, bitch. Even though not a lot of people enjoyed Starboy, you feel me? Regardless of the fact, there's still tracks on there that are great songs. It didn't. It probably didn't need to be 18 tracks, but hey, 
You feel me? Regardless, it was a it was a good album. It was a good album. And that just goes to show that The Weeknd is an artist who can drop fire when he needs to drop that heat. He dropped Starboy. Everybody's like, yo, man, where, where Abel at? Where, where, where the cocaine at? Where the drugs? Get, bring your love, baby. I can bring my shit. Where that at, bro? What, what's going on, man? You out here, <clears throat> he out here singing about cars and stuff. We, we want the real Abel back. <laughs> well, you got it. You got it. I got it. You got it. I'm going to be blasting this EP for the rest of the freaking, what, what month we in? We pretty much in April now. I'm going to be blasting this bitch. Until he dropped a full project. Yep. Until he dropped that full project, bro. Because um, this is fire. This is amazing. My favorite track gotta be uh, Call Out My Name. My two favorite tracks. No, three, actually. Call Out My Name, Try Me, and Hurt You. Those are my... Those are my no, and Privilege. I, man, I like the whole damn thing. I can't even... I, I can't even say just one track. I like the whole thing, bro. The whole damn thing I freaking love. And I love the lyrics especially. I love the lyrics especially. And I believe that The Weeknd was talking about Selena in one of them tracks. Or two of them tracks, bro. Like, for real. But I don't give a damn. Selena, bitch, you, <laughs> thank you. <laughs> thank you. Because whatever you did to this man, <laughs> he, he, letting his, he letting his pain out on these tracks. So shout out to you, you dumbass. Um, I ain't got nothing else to say, bro. I have nothing else to say about this EP. I would love for a full length project. Or hell. He could drop six tr six songs now. And <clears throat> and then drop another six e song EP. I don't freaking know. Later down the year. And then drop the whole thing. I don't know. Hey, whatever Abel got planned, man. I'm, I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it. I'm ready for it. But like I said, I feel like this one. This is for the OGs, bro. This is, this is, this is the able that we wanted, and we got it, bro. No complaints. No issues, no problems, no nothing. Like, I, I have nothing else to say. Um, y'all let me know in the comment section your thoughts and your opinions on this EP. Let me know if you liked it. Let me know if you didn't like it. Uh, if you didn't like it, you a bitch. And I really don't give a damn how you feel about that. You, you a bitch. Um, yeah. I'm out of here, man. Uh, if you guys enjoyed, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, shout out XO. As always, as always, shout out XO. Shout out Abel, shout out Belly, shout out Nav, shout out 88 Glam, shout out Black Atlas, shout out Lamar, shout out Hailey, shout out Cash, shout out Sal. Shout out everybody in XO, bro, bro, for real. Shout out to producers, everybody doing their thing over there, man. And I, I can't wait to see what he has in store for the rest of the year because we only in april we're pretty much in april now we're only in april bro i can't i i i'm done bro i if if i was if i was fat no 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 if i was skinny i didn't gained at least 15 pounds bro for each track so that means if i was skinny and i gained a bunch of weight that means i'm about 550 right now dog I gotta get liposuction because of this freaking album, son. Oh my gosh.